three, two, one, power up! And they're off all three Red Alliance machines moving and autonomous. Blue Alliance has two moving. Here comes the Moose now scoring for that Red Alliance. That's looking pretty good for Red. Yeah, that's a ranking point for your Red Alliance. All three Red Machines able to break that line. Completing their auto quest with Moose's score in the scale. Nicely done, Red Alliance. I Ram living up to their name, ramming into those Red Alliance machines. Already caused the Celtics to drop a cube. Celtics now having to go over to their human loading station to try to fill back up again. I Ram taking up a defensive posture. And here comes the Moose. Satisfied with the way their switch is looking. They're going to try to score on that scale. Up, up in the air goes 1065. Extends their arm. And they own it. Red Alliance begins ticking away two points per second now, thanks to the Moose. Up, up. They go again. Moose wants to score another one. And yeah, that's a two cube advantage now for your Red Alliance in the scale. Blue Alliance just placing a cube in that switch. Oh no. I Ram did a little too much ramming. They lost a piece of their bumper. They will be disabled for the rest of this match. We'll see if they can get that fixed for their next match. They'll need to take that back to the pits. Meanwhile, we have 40 seconds left in this match. Moose working the exchange. That holonomic drivetrain slipping and sliding around makes it easy for them to line up at that exchange zone. Under 30 seconds now left in the match. Red Alliance with a commanding lead as we enter end game. And there goes Moose. Boost power up just about to expire for the Red Alliance. And so is the match. Nicely done, Red Alliance.